All right, thank you for joining Claudian and Comprise here today. Uh, first of all, I want to thank Claudian for allowing Comprise coming in here to talk about our solution, our partner in crime, I like to call it, our partner in justice, where you start to see what we can do from an overall solution perspective when we start talking about, uh, about data. So yes, we are here. The Zettabyte era is here to stay, and data is growing. And how are you going to manage that moving forward? So during this presentation, what we want you to take away is, let me first off ask a question to the group. How, from your CIO down to, to you, how are budget affected? Are they staying flat? Are they rising? Are they lowering? Give me a perspective of what your budget is doing. Going up. That's good. That's good. You rarely hear that. We rarely hear a flat. That's a good thing. Hey, you get to spend more on this technology that's over here. But for the majority of industries, is people are looking at how do I reduce costs around my media and entertainment? How do I handle the amount of data that continues to grow from HD to 4K to 8K? So that's what we're going to talk about a little bit, this data growth and how to manage that with, with, with flat budgets. But more importantly, we start to talk about how end users interact with their files um, and, and that object store as we move forward and how we can reduce that cost by 70% with no disruption to the end user. And then finally, we'll talk about the combined solution. I talked about partner and justice, how we can scale on demand. So we can start very small, allow you to grow over time as, as needed in your, in your environment. So what's the problem that media entertainment faces, faces with data today? The problem is 80% of this data is unstructured. And over the last two years, We've created 90% of that data. How are we managing this data? We can't continue to do what we've done legacy by throwing in a tier one solution like NetApp or like Isilon. There's got to be a better way to manage the data for your, for your, within your solution. Not only that, if you think about what Gartner is saying, over the next five years, data will grow at 5x. 5x. So if you're having a problem managing your data today, how are you going to handle it moving forward? And as you can see, most of that data is inactive. So what does Comprise do? Before I get into a little bit about how a combined solution helped the media and our team customer, let me tell you about what Comprise does with Claudia. We go into an environment where a software solution that allows you to look at all your files, all your unstructured data in the environment. So your video files, audio files. We'll give you a picture into that. We'll tell you how old they are. We'll tell you access time, modification time, who's using what, what departments are using to give you a full picture of that data. True analytics. We even go into deep analytics that you can build some kind of cool plans, plans around. So we do that and then we help move it to a object store like Cloudia. So a combined solution. And what ends up happening is what you see here is in an environment where they were spending $10 million on a NAS solution, we came in and talked about, let's give you visibility in your data. That's the first point we wanted to do, give visibility to that data. So that's where Comprise came in. We gave visibility to that data. Then we came in with the best object store on the planet, Cloudian, and built a solution that ultimately had 70% cost savings. So that's huge. That allows us to go invest in the technologies that are around here on the floor. So, truth be told, there's been solutions around in the marketplace for a while that's done sort of this archiving data movement, data analysis, never comes together. But if you look at why aren't organizations looking at this? It's been very difficult and expensive to understand the data. No longer with Comprise. Comprise gives you that picture. We'll give you a picture into that data to that very, very cost effectively. Then if you think about how people have moved data in the past, users have lost the path to the data. We're transparent to the end user when you use Comprise. We move the data to Cloudian and they think they're accessing it like it's on their desktop today. That's how simple and easy it is from that side. Lastly, I'd like to pick on a former employer of mine, is a lot of these archiving solutions that 
didn't have data analytics, were more cost, costly than the primary solutions that were out in the marketplace. Why invest in those solutions? When you look at Cloudy and they can reduce your cost by, by 70% along with Comprise. So, in essence, we take a look at it from this way. We talked about the data growth. We need solutions to move those in, in effect, or the inactive files to more cost-effective storage platforms. And to newer storage platforms, like Object Store with Claudia. Here's where I want to go in touch. We can start very small in an environment. Usually in media entertainment, we're talking about petabytes and petabytes of data. If you want to point us at a 100 terabyte post-production file server, we can do that and easily move that and archive it to a cloudy. And as you look at the other shares in the environment and want to scale, very easy to scale with Cloudian, very easy to scale with Comprise. And the beauty with Comprise is we don't charge you to scale, scale off the infrastructure. We just, we just charge on a per scan of what you're scanning. So again, scale as needed. Very, very simple, very easy to scale, very affordable. So I'm going to jump into a demo and kind of see how this looks from a user interface. And we will, we will try to do this. Beautiful, we got there. So this is when you go to a comprise director that's, uh, that, that we have, you get the user interface experience. So this is, this is an environment we scan for a media entertainment customer, 195 terabytes, this, we call this our donut. We can actually look at how old the files are, how many files there are in this solution. These are adjustable. We can go deep dive. I told you about a little bit about the analytics. We can look at what are the video files, what are the archive files, what are the log files. We can even get more in depth to that. What are the size of those files? So I have a little travel scrolling here. Who are the top users of these, of these, of these files? So we give you all this data analytics as part of the solution and then allow you to create plans in that solution. So I may have Studio Y here that I simply point and comprise at, scan their share, and we've analyzed all that data, and now I want to make a plan on that. I can simply look at the plan, and you'll see this just over here. Maybe I don't want to archive everything after three years. I want to do it after six months. Look at how much cost savings we just created in the environment. We just created an additional 100K cost savings if that's the way you want to archive the, the, the data off to Cloudia. And then once we're done editing it, it's simple point click and we can activate and move the data to Cloudia. Again, a lot more in depth than we can get into a demo here, but I'm uh, at my eight minutes.